Hey guys, Mike DeWitt here, 10th Planet Springfield Superhero Jiu-Jitsu Academy. I'm here with my wife, Ashley DeWitt. Um, we're gonna go over a technique here off of an arm and guillotine uh, to get a back take, and then a couple options once we get to the back. So we'll start here in an arm and guillotine situation. In guard, basically it's, uh, our, our choke is not working, um, they're hand fighting, uh, whatever's going on here. Uh, sometimes it's just difficult to find the choke. My right arm, my choking arm is gonna shoot across and find under her armpit. That hand comes through. So now her neck is stuck under my armpit. Her arm is being pulled up. I'm in a gable grip. I wanna think about the arm that is under the armpit, the thumb facing me. And I wanna reach around and grab the blade of my hand. And I'm gonna clamp my elbows down towards my ribs. You might feel like you wanna go here, but it, it opens up a little bit of space on the far side for their head to kind of pop through the other side of your body. So what we really want to do is we want to just keep this gable grip nice and tight towards our chest and our elbows clamping down. All right, from here, I'm going to hip escape out underneath, raising that arm, and I'm going to take her right over my, the left side, my left side here, and I'm going to follow. Once we get to mount here, I'm going to pummel my foot back in like I'm giving a three-quarter mount, and what that's going to do is that's going to turn into my hook once I get to her back. Okay, once I let her arm, her arm that I don't have trapped, pass in between our bodies, it's the only way that she can turn. I'm gonna release my grip, keep my hook tight around her armpit, and I'm gonna slide my knee up her back here. Once I do that, I'm gonna sit, I'm gonna chair sit all the way back here, switch to my wrist control, come all the way back and start to set up my back attack. Once we've got our wrist control and we start to go for the back, most of the time people are gonna to start to leg press and um, go back to our underhook side. We're gonna switch our legs. We're gonna look for a body triangle here. If we can, we'd like to get under the chin if her chin is up. While we're hand fighting, if her chin is down, that's okay. We're gonna clear the head, go to a gable grip. I'm gonna bring my leg over the top of her shoulder, plant my foot down cross my feet over her grip. I'm gonna take her over. So once we've taken her over, we'll bring our feet together, our heels together. I'm keeping a nice uh, bend in her, in her shoulder this way towards her head. And I'm gonna use my feet to open, switch my foot to her armpit, and I'll lock the triangle real quick from here. Bring the arm to my chest, fix my lock, keep it nice and tight, and give her a little squeeze for the finish. So again, we're here and our arm and guillotine is not working. We're going to shoot our arm across to that armpit here. Take her right over, follow her to mount, give her that three-quarter mount position as she starts to turn through because she wants to escape that, uh, that neck crank that that 100% can turn into. I'm going to let her post, keep my underhook tight, chair sit. As I chair sit, I'm looking for wrist control, clearing, looking for the choke if I can get there. If not, she leg presses, takes us back to the underhook side, body triangle, clear the head, foot over the top, boom, break that grip, tuck it in, find her hand, lock her up nice and tight, for a tap. All right, guys, so 100% is an option off of the uh, arm and guillotine there that we can look to take the back, and uh, anytime you can find the back, you can usually find a truck. Um, Obviously, 10th Planet is heavy on the truck, so that's always gonna be an option that we look for. Uh, look out for that video coming up next. Uh, or just visit us here at 10th Planet Springfield Superhero Jiu-Jitsu Academy in Springfield, Oregon.